Ave oh Maria, piena de gracia, e Senhor é contenta. Yung parang, para bang nag, ano siya, nagsashanting sila, na ang sabi, naririto na ang mahal na ina. Emma de Guzman was born December 8, 1949 in Cabanatuan, Philippines. Widowed with three children in 1984, she went to Singapore where she found work as a domestic helper. She attributes her first mystical encounter, a whirlwind, at a church where a leaf landed on her foot which bore a piece of paper advertising a possible job in Ontario, Canada. In Canada, her best friend, Sol Gaviola, had organized a pilgrimage to the Fatima Shrine in Youngstown, New York in 1991 and took her along. Emma mentioned that the Virgin Mary taught her how to pray the Holy Rosary and requested her numerous times to pray them over and over again through the course of three successive nights. In addition, she claims that the Virgin Mary emphatically immersed Emma's emotions through the various mysteries of the Rosary as if she were actually living each decade. Emma claims to have met Jesus Christ on two separate occasions. The first occasion was in the old chapel of Our Lady of Fatima in Youngstown, New York, under the guise of an old man. Inside, I saw this man, man standing by the crucifix like this. You know, he's, he's um, uh, as if uh, he was uh, praying. So he was there st uh, standing also, and I pray. I said my uh, prayer, and then I went to the pew, to the pew, and I knelt down. The second occasion was during a trance, to which she claims that Jesus directed her to a copy of the New Testament of the Bible. It was a, a bright, bright uh, Then there was, there was a figure, you know, and I heard a voice. I couldn't even look because it was really, really, really uh, bright. And then I heard a voice and said, My child, I want you to get up and look at me. And it's the New Testament. So I was reading it. But I felt that it's not that that book. It was a brown a brown book. I didn't even read it. I just put my hand, I touched it, and then something happened to my heart. You know, there was, you know, my heart. You know, it's like that tingling sensation, just like what I felt. You know, when I, the first time you know, I was in uh, in um, Fatima, I felt it. You know, oh my lord. Many of Emma's followers during her Wednesday group meetings attested to the fragrances and oils which seeped out of religious statues in the home. In 2009, a letter was circulated by unknown parties claiming the Virgin Mary predicted the results of the upcoming presidential election in the Philippines. She was, she's wearing the uh, golden golden sash and then golden mantle. Yung yung belo niya gold. Kaya ang salita niya sa ang ating mahal na ina. I am the mother of love, peace, and joy. According to Emma de Guzman, the Blessed Virgin Mary has only chosen to appear to her annually on two specific dates: the Nativity of Mary which is on September 8th, and the Feast of the Immaculate Conception, which is on December 8th, which also coincides with Emma's birthday. An exception occurred in December 2009 when Emma refused to broadcast the message she had allegedly received to the public. She also notes that the Virgin Mary does not arrive immediately, but is first introduced by singing angels.
According to an Action News 3 New York documentary on Emma's claims of apparition, belief in golden glitters during apparitions date back to 1917 and are commonly referred to as escarchas. After obtaining samples of Emma's collected gold dust and compare them to common glitter found in holy cards, electron analysis showed no difference between the two materials yet Emma's golden dust remained the same when exposed to high contents of hydrochloric acid. Followers of Emma maintains that the glitters appear mysteriously on her face during trances as recorded in various video recordings. Furthermore, the golden dust collectively amounts on its own, saved on a white sheet where the Guzman sits during her apparition. Video recordings of Emma's partial stigmata manifesting include forehead wounds, a lot of blood, and uh, back scourging, palms, and foot. And then in like five minutes, there'll be like maybe. Oh my Jesus, save us from the fire of hell. And lead all souls into heaven, especially those who most need thy mercy. 